When doing exception handling in Python, you have a try block and an accept block. And you can also have a finally block, which is used to clean up code actions such as closing a connection to a database or file, or maybe just printing out some kind of message to output. The finally clause is always the last code executed in your exception handling code, whether or not an exception occurred. Let's take a look at an example of how to use a finally block in your exception handling in Python. So here again we have this try accept block where we ask the user how old are you and print out their age if it's valid, otherwise it prints invalid integer was entered. And we could very easily add a finally block like this and just do anything that we want in there. End of program or have a nice day. How about that? Okay. Run the program and then this, whether or not an exception happened, so no exception happened, print out, out night, have a nice day. If an exception happens, it still prints out have a nice day. Whether or not an exception happened, it's always going to execute the code that's in the finally block. And this is typically used when you're working with files and you want to close the, make sure the connection is closed to the file or working with the database, making sure that connection is closed or, or whatever it is, any kind of cleanup type action. So something a little bit more useful than what I'm showing in this example. But just know that if you ever need to run any kind of code, whether or not an exception was thrown, just add a the third clause to your exception handling called finally and add whatever code you need in there.